Right, some people get nervous about ceviche, right? Because it involves raw seafood. But today we've got an easy recipe that calls for cooked shrimp. Erica Schlick is the author of The Wandering Palette, which is a collection of travel inspired paleo recipes. They're so good. Check this out. Ceviche is one of those foods that makes it so easy to make an easy appetizer or a very simple weekday lunch or dinner. It's perfect when you want something a little bit on the lighter side and I'm gonna show you a super easy way to make a delicious paleo version today. So we're gonna start by making our lime sauce. So I've got two limes that have been squeezed here and I have about a tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil and I have one tablespoon of garlic powder and one tablespoon of sea salt. And we're just gonna keep this on the side here. We'll go ahead and whisk that together. And that's gonna tie all our ceviche together here. So now we're gonna get started by mixing in the different ingredients. And I've got one pound of cooked shrimp that's been cut. And I've got about a cup and a half of quartered cherry tomatoes. And you can do as much or as little depending on how much extra vegetables and fillings you want in it, or you can just keep it more on the fish side. And I've got one cucumber that has been diced and quartered. So I'm gonna go ahead and use my rubber spatula and just start getting this mixed together here. And again, it really is personal preference. If you wanna add a little bit more veggies in there, you can totally do that. And then we're gonna add in our avocado. So I've got two avocados that have been diced and I've gone ahead and put a little bit of lime juice on there to keep them from oxidizing. And again, we're just gonna get this mixed in. You don't need to overly mix it yet. And last but not least, we're gonna add in some fresh chopped cilantro. And this is just gonna give it a really nice kind of herby flavor. And that is it. We're gonna go ahead and mix that together. And now we're gonna pour our lime juice mixture on this. And you can always add a little bit extra lime at the end. I like to do it so it's not too, too soupy. And what I've done with my shrimp beforehand is I've actually let it marinate in the fridge overnight with about three lemons, just to kind of give it that really nice ceviche kind of cured flavor. So that already has a lot of lemon on it. And then we're just adding in that lime. And that is it. Such an easy meal, so easy to use this as an appetizer. You can do this as an easy weekday lunch. It's absolutely delicious, so simple, so healthy, and you can eat it by itself or you can eat it with some grain-free chips, grain-free tortillas, whatever your fancy is, it's gonna go absolutely delicious. So you can get this recipe on my website. It's thetrailtohealth.com and you can find other healthy and delicious recipes in my cookbook, Wandering Palette, which is also available on my website and Amazon as well.